it raises an interesting point, though, about football being a business. And if this is a business decision, let's talk about that. Vic, here's a guy that's projected number one. Mm -hmm. One of his teammates last year was injured. Marcus Lattimore ruined his draft status, ruined his knee, and basically cost him a lot of money. If it is true that Jadavion Clowney is not playing because he's worried about being injured for the season going into the NFL draft, does that help him or does that hurt him? You can do both. I mean, in today's social media environment with uh, athletes, uh, it plays a huge role. Social media plays a huge role in promoting your brand. Mm -hmm. Back when I mean, Randall was playing, we didn't have a brand. We just had the Seahawks. I mean, you guys, it's evolved over the years. Yeah. And so with social media, you have a personal brand that can affect your draft status. Uh, everything from uh, YouTube to everything, everyone's putting their information out there, you're getting viewed, there's no hidden players out there, so you're getting viewed, and so your brand's out there, so you have a market, and so you have to market yourself. Along with that, you can be labeled as well. Right. Yeah. As being soft, right. uh, being injury prone, mm -hmm. you got players that fumble prone. So it can hurt him in the long run if he sustains an injury or gets an injury in the next level, yeah. and they say he doesn't perform, they say, well, you know, well, this is kind of his, his history. Yeah. He doesn't perform. Yeah. We all know that playing professional athlete, after two days, you play hurt. Say something mm -hmm. on you that's hurt. Mm -hmm. So there's a difference between injured and hurt. Yeah. We all play hurt throughout the season because something's going to be affected. And you're going to play through let, that. Let me raise this point. Since Jadavion Clowney has announced he's going to return to South Carolina, they've raised ticket prices by $6. Mm -hmm. The organization the college is making a lot of money selling jerseys nike's making a lot of money selling jerseys none, huh? um there are more media attention there's more media attention more media focus on this school than ever before there's a lot of money being generated and he's sitting on the sideline worrying about his professional career and how he's going to feed his family later on in life should we be mad at him I don't think you can be mad at him, you know. Um, I feel like, like Randall said, I don't want to jump to conclusions too quickly. You know, it is one game. You know, he has had some issues earlier in the season in terms of conditioning. He missed the game before truly because of an injury. I think the surprising thing for me with this is that he made that decision after being cleared by the coach. You know, right. that that's that's where I'm having a little bit of the issue. But I, it's hard to it's hard to be mad at him because you are looking at millions of dollars. This is a decision based yeah. on your future, your family's future. And most of these guys are coming from a background where mm -hmm. they are the sole providers and right. everybody yeah. is banking on them, right. you know, making it to that next level so that everybody can eat. Absolutely. So, you know, yeah. it, it, and they're, there's so much pressure on them to do that that you know now they are thinking about it more like a business. And that's like, the word what would pressure, I do? man. Yeah. The pressure. Yeah. We don't. We don't. We don't know what this guy's facing. Yeah. Man. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Absolutely. They don't want to look at that though. Yeah. You know, but man, this kid, you yeah. know, we just don't know what kind of pressure he's facing, true, man, yeah. on yeah. and off the field. You yeah. never really know the true story. So. Only Jadavion does. Good luck yeah. to you, young man.